Oh, the Prince Cooker. We just call them Prince Cookies. Uh, I, I like the ones with the white in between more. Uh, these are nostalgic. Oh, so good. Oh, so good. Damn. Oreos. <laughs> if we had Oreos when we were kids, I would definitely have an addiction of uh, Oreos. Definitely. 100%. Mm. Ooh, uh, two. Okay, one more thing about football and then I'll quit. Who do you think is going to be in the finals? I think France. And like South Korea or Japan. Yeah, you also think France? That's good, still a neighbor. Still a neighbor country. <laughs> Hey guys, I have some potatoes. You didn't have Oreos as a kid? No, I'm too old for that. We did not have Oreos. What a blondie, how are you doing? Huh? Ah, so Oreos already existed, but just not in Europe. Gotcha. Damn. We had everything with, with the prints on it. And um, MB, BM, cooker. How are they calling them? Potatoes? Yeah, I know. How did the potatoes get here? I don't know. I just know that I think I will be eating potatoes for the rest of a long time a very long time so we have potatoes Ooh, uh oh I feel okay maybe this will be the super super last thing I say about football today but uh, yeah it's because I, I jinxed I jinxed it or maybe you jinxed it but um, all the like the the bigger ones that were good that had their golden era, I think they're all going to go out because Germany's out, Belgium is out. Because I said that um, the Netherlands were gonna win, and he didn't believe me. He didn't believe in my tarot reading psychic psychic abilities. I don't know. I don't know why I'm yelling. Why do I yell sometimes? I know that I sometimes yell because the situation is beyond my control. <laughs> that makes sense. <laughs> oh, come on. Ooh. I'll be, I can be, um, Close by. Oh, separated. Majority of chat eats their Oreos separated. Only two people dunk them in milk. Mm -hmm. Please, Pierre, take pictures. I want to see. Potatoes are going in the microwave, in my potato express, because we're going to steam them in the little bag, in the microwave, and it's a lot quicker than if you boil them. So you can also boil them in, in boiling water or in water. That's okay. It's just going to take a longer time as if you steam them, it will take less long. Um, a 
How old are you, Sai? <laughs> Pierre is 30. Yeah, let's let's keep it on that. Pierre is 30. <laughs> I am... I thought, Sai, aren't you like 24? Like, aren't you like my brother? Then I am five years older. Because I am so old. I am that old. 25, oof. End of your life. Oh yeah, you just turned 25, right? Oh, yeah, she does. Wow. You did some nice logic thinking, Parrot. Shit. <laughs> How did I not see this? <laughs> oh my god. We're also going to... Oh my god. Okay. We're going to preheat the oven. Old. I am gold. Not old, I'm gold. We have our baking mat. We need something to press our, to smash our potatoes. Oh yeah, I still have to write down the name. Pierre, would you like pink? And Emerson. Emerson is going on the board for the very first time. Very exciting. If you're still here, you can choose what color you would like. Uh, it's blue, green, pink, orange, red, purple, yellow. Yo. Good choice. Pierre, 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 Goes for. Oh, happy 30 months! Look, you're not 30 years old, you're like 30 months old. Who said that? Who said you were older than 30 months? <laughs> I'm going to choose the color for our friend Emerson. Emerson? I have to wipe the board and put the names of this month on. See, you're 30 months taller. <laughs> Maybe we are. Maybe we are. And we're proud of it. Are we? Okay. Um, I'm very sorry to say this. But we need garlic. So this is the garlic oil with a little bit of rosemary that I saved from the um, garlic confit that we made. And this is... Does anyone know what this is? Like it looks a bit strange but does anyone know? Bins the oil. You're definitely not 50. Hi, Abby. Body parts? No, that's from Wednesday. Okay, maybe here. Your sister is 55. Oh, wow. Hi, Abby. It's not chilly. Wait. Maybe a bit, a bit, yeah, there are tomatoes. Actually, it's, <laughs> it looks very strange, but it is a tomato confit. <laughs> but um, like the white parts are crushed garlic. <laughs> we uh, roasted the garlic bulb. Video on that soon. You want to see a little bit part of the video already? I'll show you 
the finished product. Hi, Tina. I am a comfy. That's true. Mmm. Yeah, it's really delicious. This is how the the it was in the Hi Gnome! How are you doing? Mmm. What fat did I use? Um I just used olive oil. Um because the the oven goes lo low. The oven goes low so you can use olive oil and then I added some garlic, um pepper, salt and rosemary for flavor. How are you doing, Noam? Good morning. How did you sleep? The Clara Wink emote. Oh, well, <laughs> like, I think, Noam, I think you were the only one that was using it, but I can, I can re-add it if you want. Because I don't think I have another another um, emote wait animated emote yet for to fill the hole oh look you want it here it's back if you refresh, I think you'll uh, you'll get it. The winky again. I already had a coffee. It was um, a very interesting, fascinating process to to get to this cup. Uh, lukewarm coffee. Yeah. It was, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> exactly that. Okay, um, let me check on my potato. Oh my god, it's the weird Christmas song again. Wait, <laughs> like, how is this Christmas? Hello, because you're fabulously funky. funky. <laughs> that so there you have to wink again <laughs> ipa says it's not your time yet okay <sighs> not your time yet we need our silicon baking mat we need garlic we just had a cappuccino with um, caramel syrup which was nice very nice. We have new lights. How do you like the lights? What are you thinking? Are we there? Does it need a little bit improving? I think it's very good. I'm like much brighter and overall light lit up. Very cozy. You Good morning, race flaps. Welcome, everyone. Welcome, raiders. How are you doing? Thank you so freaking much for choosing my kitchen. You will not be able to raid my fridge, though. I will stop you there. But I can get you a coffee if you want. Good. Actually, it's um almost five in the evening here. How? What time is it there? How was your stream? Thank you so much. How is everyone doing? Fun! I'll read Ella for Schnigglies. You can, she's all yours. What am I making today? 8 a.m. Ooh, where do you where do you live? You live in America somewhere?
I'm getting my, what are we making today? We're making something very cozy, very delicious today. Um, here are the recipes. We're making smashed potatoes, so they're steaming now. Now we're gonna smash them on the baking tray, put some um, garlic oil over them, some fresh thyme, pepper, salt. They're going to go in the oven uh, so they get all crispy and juicy. And then we're going to make caramelized um, onion with chicken. So I have some chicken thighs that we're going to sear up first. Then we're going to start making the caramelized onions. Beer. Okay, yeah, okay. Carolina. Carolina represents. <laughs> nice. We're gonna make some nice, smooth caramelized onions with the chicken and with some apple cider. We don't have apple cider here in Belgium, so I just bought um, unsweetened apple juice. Clarimerized. <laughs> yes. Definitely. So this is for the garlic oil for the potatoes those are the potatoes hello potato potato yeah. you don't want to steam them all the way so I'm going to keep them out here um, and then we're gonna check if they're steamed enough or they need a little bit more or less or we'll see now it's time for us to cry. I still have not gotten my uh, goggles, but we're going to cut a lot of onion now. Okay, it's gonna be fine. I'm, I will survive, I promise. I will make it out dry. <laughs> and I also promise that I'm not really crying because okay maybe I, I will cry a little bit on the inside can we we should we should make this an um, a prediction what do you think what do you think a prediction Drier than our humor? Yes. I don't. You think it's not even possible, but it is very much possible. Will Clara cry from the onions? Yes, she's a cry baby. I am, I am. No, she's a boss. Okay, you got two minutes to vote. Go. I do. I do. I'm a big crybaby. What's wrong with being a little bit emotional? A lot. Are there any other um, emotional people here in chat? Easy money to win. Hmm. I just want to say last time with all the onion cutting. Okay. I did not cry. I think that was the most amount of onions I ever cut in my entire life. Why, why did I do that again? What was the... When did I have to cut so many onions? I forgot. And I did not cry. She'll cry from the, nip from the onions. Why would I cry? Why would I cry? Oh. Oh, wait. Will Clara cry from the onions? Why is that a... That's... Twitch is not allowing this. Will Clara cry? Oh wait, I think I know. Ah! 
I think there's Okay, apparently crybaby was a, a, the word that was wrong I think because it might seem offensive or Will I cry cutting these onions? Yes or no? I have food and coffee. What kind of coffee and what kind of food, Sai? I'm very happy. First you had an amazing nap. Now you have the best there is in life. Food and coffee. I mean, what else can you wish for? I am here. <laughs> what else can you wish for other than that? Okay, so I'll tell you about my week. A lot of weird stuff happened. First, my car had to go to the garage because it was like the engine light was on. So I had to take a day off from work to get my car to the garage because they, they are open at very random and annoying times. So I had to um, get a day off. Fortunately, I could. So I took it in. They read it out. It took them two hours to read my car out. <clears throat> they called me and said, um, yeah, so we reset the car and the light was out. So actually it was just a failure of the, of the car. Nothing is wrong with it. It's just the light went on. I was like, um, okay then. So they said, if the light um, starts, like, turns on again, you do have to bring it back in. So we need to do a, a full check. So I was like, why didn't you just do the full check now? But okay. Next morning, I drove to the train station. The freaking light burned again it's like why did i take my day off just to know now that i have to bring it back in okay whatever i called them they said oh yeah um you have to take it back in can you take it back in today at 4 30. i was like madam i am at work now i cannot just take off and bring the car because <laughs> he was like yeah but we're very busy um okay another moment maybe like okay so now we, we got another moment it's going to be this monday that i will fold myself into turns and hoops to get my car back in the garage to get it checked again and then she said yeah so we can do another check and then um we will make another appointment for you to bring in the car so we can repair it i was like so I have to bring it in a third time to have it like, to have it okay to, for them to fix it. She's like, yes. I'm like, okay then. So yeah, that's, that was with the car. Then there were some very important papers, documents that the, um, how do you say notaris? How do you say not? <laughs> Car stuff is such a pain in the butt. Yeah, it's true. It's true, Pixel. I'm not gonna allow it, but I'll just say it out loud, so yeah. Otherwise, I'll forget to unallow it. The notary, okay, okay, okay. Apparently, I'm very emotional. Won't argue it. <gasps> oh, Pierre. Okay, let me first check. Everyone is saying, oh, wait. So four people are saying that I will cry because I'm a crybaby and they put in a lot of points. And five people are saying that I'm a boss. But it's just le like not a, not a lot of points. So if the crybaby people win, they will not win a lot of points. <laughs> oh, that's good. You raced car again? No, I drove to Amsterdam. 
Mocha and leftover congee. Mm. Nice. Oh boy. Would have gone all in. <laughs> so yeah, so um, the notary, thank you, Sai, send us some very important documents that needed to be um, signed. And like we signed them and I sent them. And then a um, couple of days later, she sent me an email me and Vincent an email saying like uh, yeah can you please fill in the documents because I really need it because uh, next week you have to sign the contract blah 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 blah, blah and uh, I really need it I was like oh but I already sent them this is weird how did I not send them to you we, we did that and then Vincent <laughs> double checked and he was like Clara you only sent them to me you didn't even send them to to the notary like so, let this be a lesson for all of us. <laughs> Always double check when you write an email to someone. Not crying yet. It is getting more difficult though. Oh, you laughing? You laughing, Dark? Okay, you're allowed to laugh. Yeah, it's a very. It, I'm, it's not really a sketchy garage. I feel like they're just. Um. Like, nonchalant. How do you say nonchalant in, in English? Arrogant? No, not really arrogant. It's like, la yes, laid back. Thank you. Oh, Giregure! Hi, like thank you so much. Ella pet, ella pet. You like the emote? <laughs> like, guys. It's like tearing up a little bit. You see it? But it's not there. I'm not crying yet. <laughs> Thank you, Gregory. Very much appreciated. What color would you like? We have orange, green, blue, pink, red, purple, yellow, white. Nonchalant in English too. Oh, there you go. Easy. Yesterday's wordle was a word that I didn't know what it was. Um, but I know I forgot what the word was again. Fe, she, she, shafe, chef, c h a f e, chef, 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 chef. They also say nonchalante, <laughs> no chalante. I don't know. Scuff? No. Sh no. Okay, we're at the last onion. Okay. Oh, it's very difficult. I need to get back in there, tear. I will win this. I will. There will be victory. As for I will not be called a crybaby. Do you have an, a Dutch jersey? I may have something orange laying around. Did did we did the Netherlands win officially? It's like is USA out? I'm not a cry. Guys, I did it. Look at me. Dry as the Sahara. Oh, that's why you didn't eat, Sai. 
Is that why? Because you were reading a 700 page book. Shh, shh. One hour played. Oh. Yay! So, the ones who voted for two, they got their points. There you go. Congratulations, everyone who knew that I was a boss and not a crybaby. I hope you get. Oh, oh, I was gone there. Hi. Um, this was a test. This was a test to see if you, <laughs> if you were still paying attention. Oh, oh, hi. <laughs> what was I saying? I was just talking about me being a crybaby. Hi, Gekrandelish. Hello. How are you doing? Welcome. Welcome to the kitchen. How is your day going? Or does it still have to start? These are my onions for the caramelized onions. You haven't a muted mic. Should I believe you? No, people can hear me. Hello. Hello. I think I accidentally muted the mic. Sorry. We can. Hi, Mathematica. How are you doing? Um, I'm doing well. I just, I'm, um, fighting against the onion tears and we're getting everything ready for our nice caramelized onion uh, chicken that we're now going to make uh, so we need flour onions of course black pepper salt butter I'm also going to add bacon and I still have some salted butter but you can also just add regular unsalted butter and add some extra salt. Onions, apple cider, we don't have apple cider but I have unsweetened apple juice so that's what's going in. Oh guess what happened yesterday? What happened? You scammed all of my beans. <laughs> That's me. Hi. I'm the problem. <laughs> it's me. You were talking about Sai reading some kind of book. Yeah. My nail broke and my pretty nails are ruined. Oh no. Oh my god, Sai. How could you do that? But now you have to just cut all of your fingers nails and then they're nice again and pretty. Or just get one fake nail. <laughs> That will, that would, no one's gonna know. Has you, have you been watching uh, Wednesday, Pasas? I think we are almost at the last episode and I'm loving every single episode of it already. I love it. It's so moody, it's so dark and yet so nice and warm and sometimes a little bit teeny, like teenage material, but so much fun to watch. Ooh, and I've been like guessing whoever is the one, like is the the, the monster and like, oh, it's so good. Have you finished it already? I don't, it's like, playing dance, dance, dance. <laughs> Those are the only, the only moves I know. 
the mole. Who is the mole? <laughs> yes. Very much. Do I need to have watched the Adams family? No. You just have to know that they they like everything that is horror and bad. You don't actually have to like it will be it will make it well oh, they will make it clear what their relationships is and everything. Sorry, I just need my We're gonna cut up some mushrooms as well. These are gigantic. So I'll take these. I just really like the fact that I've been thinking that every, almost everyone was a suspect until they were not anymore. And then they were again. And then they were, it's like crazy. Isn't the, the song from the dance um, like a song from the 80s? Which one was it again? Who was it again? I love mushrooms, me too. The strokes? Was it the strokes? No. Oh. <laughs> I also like how everything takes like the worst turn and then when they be like, I quite enjoy this. <laughs> so good. Okie dokie. We're going to slice it up. If you still feel like the mushrooms are too big, you can have them as well. Or take the stem off, that's also a possibility. Brah, we were home literally 10 days ago and I don't recall seeing any construction for a flyover and my dad just texted it, open a new flyover that links directly to the airport on the street the house is on. No way. Okay, but that's good. That means that for your future travels, they will make it so much easier for you to go home. Besides, didn't your sister also have the same problem then? Oh, by the way, I have to tell you something. It's very important. Um, it may be like a huge change or a life changer for a lot of people. So I feel like it's my duty to tell you this important news. Ladies and gentlemen, have you considered that this month, this day, is the last day of 2022? Day, month, last month of 2022. So think about what you're going to do still this year, because you will never get the year back. It will end, it will be closed off. Okay, you will get new possibilities in 2023, but it's like, it's done. The year will be over in <laughs> 20, 
28 days? 28? You're happy? Wait, what makes you, what makes you happy that there is a new year around the corner? I mean, I think it's a good thing because lots of cool stuff is going to happen very much, but it's like, I'm always in a little bit of a wall towards the end of the year because you like, you had all these like days have passed and chances and you will get, we'll be able to create new chances and everything. I know that, but it's always a bit weird. Hi, Ikaga, Ikagawa. Sorry, Sin. End of the year. You're also happy? This month is super busy for work because my company pays before Christmas, so normally a one month schedule is now a 10. Ooh, damn. I am streaming for charity. This one, this baby right here. This apron is an apron that you can win if you every 10 euro donation gets their name in a bag and a possibility to win the apron. Uh, we're already raised so much. I cannot believe it. Um, the charity will continue until the 17th of December where I will be um, hosting the intro together with Mastodont. Uh, we're gonna have some nice talks. We're gonna do play some nice games. The old community will be there because there is also a meetup downstairs where they can all meet up, get together, get cozy, get a few drinks, follow the stream. It's gonna be nice. And then on that show, we're going to um, like it's going to be the end number of the amount of money that the entire community has raised for the warmest week, which is a Belgium initiative. Uh, it returns every year. And this year, the, the charity is um, to support the underprivileged. There you go. How are you doing? Ikakawa? Are you? I don't know. That's okay. That's that reason is definitely good enough, Flowerson. Let's see, what else do we need? Our apple cider, mushrooms, another garlic. There you go. Now we are gathering all the ingredients for the chicken. So garlic, fresh thyme and fresh sage. So we have the cute thyme here. And we have some finally, finally, I got my hands on some fresh sage. I had no luck finding any and now I did. So I bought a whole bunch and I froze um, like half of it. I put half of it in the freezer so I can take it out if I need any fresh. And when I get my dehydrator, oh my god, when I get my dehydrator, um, I will also be able to dry it myself. So that's gonna be cool. I'm going to be able to dry my own herbs so they stay fresh longer. Because if you have dry herbs, they actually don't stay good for a very long time. I've had now jars of dried herbs that are four years old, but the flavor is definitely um, losing. And when I have my dehydrator, I can just get fresh ones and dehydrate them and then I can use them for some time. It's gonna be good. Chopped fresh sage. I am well, just making some breakfast and getting ready to run some errands. Oh. 
Aww. You're too kind. Thank you so much. I do really, really appreciate you popping by on your very busy day. I hope you'll have um, a lot of fun running your errands. And I hope you get some time to chill out as well. Thank you so much for taking your time to pop in. Everyone, by the way, thank you so much. I really, really appreciate it. Even though you have busy lives, you get the time to, um, to pop in my kitchen and to say hello and to have a little chat before you continue doing your work of the day. Because time is precious. There you go. Oh, that's maybe a little bit too much. <laughs> I think I need like this amount. This I will keep apart. Hi Laura! Um, I don't know, I still have to buy, I'm, I'm going to wait until we move into the house before I buy it because otherwise it's another extra thing to move. <laughs> so I'm doing that. Oh, did they, did they make a goal? Nice. Hi, Laura. Guys, Laura has been on quite the adventure. You want to talk about it? She almost died three times. But see, she persevered like the goddess that she is. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed it, Laura. <laughs> Um, oh, we need a lot of fresh thyme, okay. We're going to zip the leaves off. Been on a camel's back. Yeah, those pictures were cool. It's like POV style. <laughs> Excuse you. My work bus route changed recently recently because of road works. An extra 15 minutes each. Ish. So you'll have to do the extra 15 minutes. Wait, how long do you have to drive normally with the bus? For an entire year? That's rough. Fun in the dunes. Nice. Well, before it used to be like 20, 30 minutes. Oh, and now an extra 15. Shh. That's not fun. That's not fun. Last week, the trains were um, striking for three days straight while my car was having the issues with the engine. <sighs> Strange times indeed. There you go. That is that. One cup of dry white wine. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Let's do that. Okay, let's see. Now I'm going to cut the bacon because that needs to go first.
First we're going to bake the bacon seared chicken, take it back out, and then we're going to start caramelizing the onions. I'm going to put the bacon and the chicken back in. The mushrooms, everything. And let's go. Hi Ulrike! Of course you do! It's, uh, it's not the cake yet because I want to give it to you on the stream, uh, on the end show. Oh wait! could have said is you the man all Ulrike wants for her birthday is matcha there you go ah I know Eduardo it's crazy right um oh I want to show you something Ulrike how was your party yesterday how was the party also true <laughs> damn it how was the party I hope you enjoyed it and how was today? I hope you enjoyed that too. I am quite energetic. Maybe I'm overcompensating, who knows? Maybe it's because the Netherlands are winning, who knows? Maybe it's because I see all of you. Maybe it's because I had my cappuccino, who knows? My friends gave me fancy matcha for Friendsgiving. <gasps> nice! Now it's dinner party later on Twilight and Mean Girls. <gasps> oh, those are very good choices. Very good choices. I can only applaud that choice of music. Damn. Wait. Wait. Can I post in Discord chat? What? You can't leave. <laughs> ah, above that. Oh. I mean from the quad biking. Uh huh. I I read I read it. I read it. <laughs> oh my god! That's so TOS. <laughs> I'm too innocent for this. Now I visualize it. Why did you let me visualize that moment? Oh my god! It will never go out of my head now. It will never, like, it's the picture is very clear now. We all... <laughs> uh, 
Well, thank you for making me read that, Hellfire Acid Face. That's so kind of you. So freaking kind of you. I'm going to prepare the chicken. Chickens. Visualize what? Um, um, well, <laughs> do you want me to say that? So Laura went quad biking and let us say that it was not comfortable seating. Yana, you know, you know what I mean? Do you know what I mean? We're currently making the chicken with caramelized onions. So I have here some nice chicky ties. Chicky ties. With the skin on. Because that is Mamma Mia. We're gonna go with three because five is too much and four leaves me with only one chicken thigh and no one wants one chicken thigh in their freezer. So that's what we're doing. Her area won't... <laughs> help chats be naughty and not even causing it I know Photoshop the quad bike and it's for a whole different website <laughs> oh my god don't do this to me <laughs> season the chicken with salt and pepper and rub with flour to coat heat large certain salt Remove the chicken, add the butter and onions. Okay. Pepper and salt. I've been good the past few streams. Very good. Are you waiting for a present from Santa or why are you so good? Hey guys, um, can, we, can we also help then? because he is doing a string for charity tomorrow and he's going to be making um, a Bloody Mary with all kinds of cool toppings. Do we have other cool toppings that he can add? I will check Laura's message. No, no, that's okay. Oh, pfft. oh, pfft. I suggested coffee glazed bacon. Oh, we have to check those little yum yums. Yum yums. Mmm, yes. Pickles. Mmm. He already has. Wait, let me check. Chicken tenders or sandwiches, hot dogs. Bacon, celery, olives, shrimp, cherry tomato, pickles, and waffle fries. Oh, those are waffle fries. Now I see. Yanyans. <laughs> Here. Oh, so pretty. Look. <laughs> Look at her going. That's so cool. Wait. Ooh. Ah, oh, that's such a cool landscape. I'm not going shopping. Oh, okay, 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 okay. That's okay. I mean, we can we can chat about it still. Egg yolk. <laughs> Yogurt. To Bloody Mary. I can only imagine. He's adding 
chicken tenders. Uh, yes. That's just blended up foods. So for our chicken, I'm now going to add just a little bit of flour. And we're gonna rub them in so they get nice and crispy. And they get a nice coating. That one is already going in. Dance, 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 dance. Rub it in, rub it in. I wasn't aware yogurt was the line. Wait, what? What? Mmm. -hmm. Hi, Hardware Barbecue. How are you doing? This lovely Saturday. Welcome to Charity Month, where we are raising money for charity. We are raising a chicken. And we're going to make nice caramelized onions. Um, I need a plate to put the chicken and the bacon in. Chicken is yummy, but other chicken is meh. That's okay. Every chicken is good chicken if you make it nice. Okie dokie. Hi, I hope you had a nice nap, Peter. Thank you for letting me know how boring I am. Toodler. Thank you for uh, rubbing that in. <laughs> or maybe thank you for letting me know how how soothing my voice is I'll go for that one <laughs> oh, okay I'm just eating I always fall asleep during your stream <gasps> oh, um, does, is that supposed to make me feel better Sai? <laughs> what? The hums, the hums, the hums, the hums. Hi, Wishy. How are you doing? Happy Friday, Saturday. Happy Saturday. I am sore and bruised, and I only went for a short ride. <laughs> Maybe they have like a cushion built in their pants. It's just sad you don't stream during sleep times. It's so sad that you don't sleep during sleep times. I'm very selective on what I fall asleep to. <laughs> Normally I don't fall asleep, I just want to lie down for five minutes and that's how it all starts. What's our perfect bedtime during for a guaranteed fast dozing time? Oh, yeah, I, I guess. I guess I can, I can imagine that. Maybe I should already take out my bacon. <laughs> the bacon is the bacon is getting very crispy. Hmm. Talking about Christmas parties. When should we do our Christmas party, guys? Hi, ho, Jerissi.
right now I am braising the chicken. Um, and then I'm going to take it out. And then we're going to caramelize the onions. We're going to add the chicken back to it. And then we have food. I have two Christmas parties and I just want to sleep. But you're going to get good food. If I do all my dishes and clean the kitchen, can I just order food? Why do you still have to clean the dishes if you did not make food? Oh, air fried chicken nuggets? Yeah. I follow you. I, I follow. I follow you, deep sea fiery. Why not like next Wednesday? On a day where I can make it, like next Wednesday. <laughs> Ooh, I want the food too. You got two weeks off. When are you going back to the UK, Laura? Rude. Very rude. <laughs> so USA is out. Because I haven't done the dishes from the past three days days. Have you like thought about getting the portable dishwasher? Oh, you're not seen. Yay. You think I do the dishes every day? It's, it's, it's a habit. Okay. When, when do you, when are we going to do the, Chris, the Christmas party guys? Um, let me get my schedule with me. Maybe we can even do the, the Christmas party because on the 18th of December, that's a Sunday, um, my brother is coming over to stream with me. Three, two, one. Yes. Uh, so we can have family with you guys as my family and my brother as family. Christmas party. We're going to make beef wellington. So I do have a brother. He's uh, 24. When did they when did they join actually? <laughs> Is that weird to ask? Okay, I'm going to take the pan off the heat because it's getting a little bit too warm. I'm gonna let that cool off. 16th is my last day of work this year. <gasps> Who said that? Where is that? <laughs> Mm -hmm. 18 good oh nice Tony okay I will talk of beef Wellington yeah so he claims my brother claims that he knows how to make beef Wellington perfectly and I said okay let's do it so I went to um, to get a nice like piece of beef for that so that is now in the freezer waiting you want to see you want to see he likes to cook too
This is the piece that we're going to use for the beef wellington. So it's gonna be good. Can you make a TikTok out of it? Maybe we can get Gordon Ramsay to review. Oh my God, does he do that? Does Gordon Ramsay review stuff on TikTok? That dude, that dude, oh. That's cool. As a Belgian, I knew the feeling. Yeah, I know. My last day of work this year is the 30th. <laughs> Mine too. Ah, sad life, sad life. The pastry is the hard part. The, the hard part, in my opinion, um, to make beef wellington is to get the pastry to be crispy. So you have to cook out all of the juices. And you have to make sure that the beef on the inside is still very juicy, but that it doesn't sink to the bottom, so you don't get a soggy bottom. That's the problem, always. Okay, butter and onions. <laughs> okay, we have our pan. I'm going to take a little bit of the fat out because it's too much now at the moment. You already see that there are some nice, nice juicy bits there on the bottom of the pan. Uh, we're all going to let that get into the caramelized onions. So get your salted butter. Ah! Hi ladies, how are you doing? Welcome to the kitchen. Happy freaking Saturday. How was today? What is one cool thing that you did today? Oh, sh <laughs> Let's do that again. Oh, Arbet, thank you. Thank you, Pierre. I might have just woken up an hour ago. All right. You went to the store. Did you get something very delicious? Melt the butter. Now we're gonna pop in all of the yum yums. So this may look like a lot, but it will shrink down all of it. Hey, latest, are you watching uh, Wednesday? Ah, oh, okay. That's that's all okay. Fresh bread. Oh. I love bread. Got my wok stuff for tomorrow and carrot stuff for karapuri. Yes, so um, I have your address. I will be there for the carrot puree. <laughs> I will bring the potatoes. <laughs> yes, I have potatoes enough. Pastry sog soggy buttons? Yes, I was. Wait. Soggy bottoms at per Great British Bake Off are either the worst or the best. Soggy bottom happens often. Oh my god, I didn't. Oh my god. Wait. Next chill stream, we have to watch his TikToks. Mostly screaming, no, you don't do that. Uh, do I want him to review my video then? I don't know. I don't know. Claret pudding, 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 pudding. 
You can still watch the shows, yeah. Um, DM Eduardo if you want. <laughs> VIP access to the show. There you go. All right. The the onions are already taking off the crunchy bits of the chicken and bacon. See, getting brown and nice. And all the flavor is getting loose. Mm. Oh, I am so, I am so ready. Stuff this in my face. The sweet potatoes were all gone for a few sad wrinkled ones. <laughs> no. <laughs> Ew. Uh, okay, Haki. Nizzy, nizzy, nizzy. Um, bon appetit, Pierre. I am only just a little bit jealous because you deserve it. Still a bit jealous. Have fun. It's going to be amazing. Enjoy the time with your sister. That's definitely also going to be amazing. Copenhagen beware. I am on my way. Nice. Go Pierre. Go, go Pierre. So now we're going to caramelize the onions. We're going to do that with a little bit of the help of um, the apple cider. And then we're going to pop the chicken back in. But now I'm going to prepare the potatoes. So what I need is a tiny bowl with some crushed garlic. This is just designed to do that, so you can scrape the the bits out. But I don't think every um, garlic crusher is designed like this. I think. Apparently, I was subscribed twice to Paramount. <gasps> oh my god, that's just that's just sad, sad loss of money. I'm sorry. I'm sorry you had to deal with that Red Wing. Runs to the kitchen. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Now I want to know. <laughs> now I want to know how your crusher looks like. Does any other garlic crusher comes apart? How kinky. <laughs> that would totally make sense for you, Sai. Okay, welcome to my onions. Right now, we're going to add half a cup of apple cider. A bit of pepper and salt. No, it doesn't. Oh yeah, yeah, it's like the good metal one. That's that's a sturdy one. Salt, pepper. It's a pain in the poo to clean. Yeah, I have found a way to clean it, but I'm not sure if you want to know, know that how I do that. Voila.
stir, stir, stir. Stir, stir, stir. A bit higher. And here we are working on the oil for the mashed potatoes. I just soak mine in hot water and it all comes out. I use, yeah, yeah, a toothpick. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Or like a fork, a fork helps too sometimes. <laughs> I hear kinky and I run over. Oh my God. <laughs> oh, you guys are so funny. I steamed some potatoes. Potatoes. And um, I need more time, you know? But basically you can choose whatever herb you, um, you put on your potatoes. I am going to go for time. I have my oil, maybe a little bit more. I have the garlic in there. I need salt and pepper. I had a dream it was bacon and alcohol. <laughs> well, none of them is what you can have at the moment, Laura. Deal with it. Only in your dreams you can have them, okay? Only in your dreams. I thought <laughs> I, I had a dream. It was kinky. <laughs> ah, that's so good. Mm. <laughs> Go cry in the corner. Man up, Laura. You're gonna be fine. Okay. Are you ready to see? Ah. <laughs> we have a smashed potato. Okay, wait. I made it a little bit thinner so it will turn out nice and crispy. That's potato number one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're gonna make them. Yeah, yeah, and then in the oven, definitely. So now, so you, so you parboil them, okay? Um, oh, I have too much. I need two sheets. Or maybe I can. You have to parboil them or steam them in the oven, uh, in the microwave or in boiling water, I mean. And then you have to smash them. <laughs> And then you have to bake them in the oven so they get nice and crispy. Brush them with some flavored oil. <laughs> this one is a, it's a long one. The thinner you get them, the crispier they'll get. There you go. I like all crisp. So, <laughs> then you can fry them. That is that. And then we're going to brush them with the oil. And the garlic.
while Christmas music is playing in the background. The third day of the advent calendar. Oh, I still have to take my candy out. Vincent's brother gave us a, an advent calendar with all licorice candy. Like it. I like it a lot. Get all of the oil. Mm -hmm. Uh. You were, you were there, I think, when I tried to coffee, or did you fall asleep then? Time. Ritz it all off. Pepper. Salt. Yeah, no, you don't have to apologize. It's fine. You're having very busy days. I can totally understand. That is for the potatoes. Now, before we put it in the oven, we're going to check on the chicken. The onions are getting golden. All the bits from the bottom of the pan are drawn in. Now, we're going to add the mushroom. The other half cup of apple cider. Put the chicken back in. The crispy chicken. And then you just have to see if you need to add more liquid or not. So everything is in now. I'm going to put the lid on, let it do its thing. And then check on the chicken and on the liquid and everything until it's perfect. Did someone say wine? I feel like I, I deserve some white wine. Let me do that. While I play an ad, is that okay? Why do you not have apple cider in Belgium? Yeah, we only have the alcohol cider ones. 
Yeah, it's very weird. I don't know why. So I have unsweetened apple juice. <laughs> that was a perfect substitute. Okay. See you in a bit. I am back. Hi. Hi. I don't know why they don't have it in Belgium actually. I have no idea. Oops. Let's get the potatoes in. But what can you do? What can you make with apple cider? Or can you drink it? Or Potatoes are going in. I'm very excited on how this is going to turn out. Hey Google, set timer for 15 minutes. All right, 15 minutes, starting now. Here, you can have some of my flame. <laughs> it's a preheated oven. Wait, what? Yeah. Always preheat your oven before putting something in. Otherwise, um, you will not get a constant temperature. So your baking time will take longer or your um, the, the thing that you put in your oven is like unevenly cooked because when an oven is preheating, it always uses a different kind of heat when uh, it's, does that make sense? <laughs> Start an apple cider business and become rich. Did we just find a hole in the market? Oh, I love little powdered donuts. Mm. Dragon Girl Shelby. Thank you for the follow. Let's have some wine. How are you doing? A red syrup, how are you doing? I only have caramel syrup. Not sure if you can do anything with it, but yeah. 
it is what it is. Okay, um, I've been cleaning up already a little bit. We have our crispy bacon here. We have our chicken with caramelized onion sauce. There's bubbling here. Bubbling like a Michael. Sorry, that was not funny. So the thing is, Sahi, we have an, we had an air fryer. And then we decided to give it to Vincent's mom because uh, she could use it better than we can. So now she has our air fryer <laughs> and we use the oven. That's, it's okay. But it's very easy to make a quick dinner, I suppose. They are still caramelizing. Now. <laughs> in the... In the pan. It still needs to go for 15 minutes or so. I'm, a, I'm going to, I'm about to go make coffee after your ad. Okay, you can, definitely. I'm, uh, I'm happy that I made you thirsty for coffee. What coffee are you gonna make? Okay, I'm going to do the dishes. Okay, sorry. The one who wins this apron is <laughs> The one who wins this apron is going to get maybe an apron that's a little bit dirty. I shall wash it first, I promise. Coffee is nothing but a thirst trap. Oh my god, it's so much it's so much more than that. Sorry. It's so much more than just a thirst trap. What are you talking about? Using the clean as I go method as I should, as any smart cook should do. Copy, hi Rexter. How are you doing, brother? How is life? Is life life? Is life fun? Is life kicking you in the butt? Let me know. It hurts so much to move. Um, so what exactly did you do? Did you join me in the push-ups earlier this stream? Okay then, Copy. You win this round. But you did not win the war. <laughs> Demolition Man. All restaurants are Taco Bell, but they failed to see all other retails would be Amazon only. What? What? Is, what, are, what are you talking about? potato masher see that's what I should really start doing Cook, uh, clean as you go yeah well it's um, it's very much work in process for me work in progress for me as well sometimes you just so so super into the cooking and you get everything out and then you're like I, I can do this and then I'll clean and then you never get to the cleaning part <laughs> so yeah there you go I 
I understood you. I don't understand. Push-ups would kill me right now. Had to work the 9.30 to 6 p.m. shift, then had to go back into work at 2 a.m. this morning, which is obstructing the time it takes me to walk home and get relaxed less than seven hours to sleep. <sighs> That's very sad. I have not seen the movie. Hi, Pablo. How are you doing? Who in What What have you heard about Avondeten? Just looking at Amazon, they're even producing their own shows on food. Yeah. Amazon is going nuts. It's crazy. Like those dudes are, are billionaires, right? Oh, Japanese curry. Wait. Are you in, in Japan already? No, okay, okay. I I was thinking like wasn't it January but you're getting into into the culture already maybe. Japanese kuri. Mm. Did you make it with the golden cubes like the um, how are they called again? With these the java curry. No, uh, normally I have others. This is another brand. Oh, here. No, oh, this. Oh, uh, the Vermont Korea. Oh, yeah, this is this is the one. Yum. Not the Java one. Okay. <laughs> That's okay. Voila, all is clean. I am happy again. This uh, this deserves a poll. Don't you agree? How do when when do you clean? As I go, good, good cook. Three days after, one, one to three days after. Pray to. I don't cook. Um, I love weird questions. I am weird. <laughs> anyway, it's okay. I did not expect that question. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, it's first Hellfire Recipe. In the future, all restaurants are Taco Bell because I guess they won the capitalism, but they fail to imagine a world where only one other huge business takes over the rest of the market. Ah. Uh, Did you see the, the documentary series called Spotify? And maybe that's like some in the same genre. No. But that that's an interesting movie then. Was it good? Shall I watch it? Do you guys do you guys recommend? Okay, so Sahi, let me tell you a secret.
But you don't see it, do you? It's like still okay. Um, so I wash my hair one time a week. Uh, and that was supposed to be today. But I didn't find the time to properly do that. So, it's hair washing day. That explains a lot. It's nice. I put some unsalted butter in there. Oh, well. Yeah, well. You know, I don't have I don't have a lot of baby hair though. Today was beard washing day. Oh, is your beard all nice and fluffy and fluffy again? Very nice. Oh, uh, you guys should you guys should smell this. It's so good. Fluffy and soft. Oh, what? Can I can I touch your beard, please? Is that a weird question to ask? Maybe. So, I definitely do not have to add more liquid. You know what? It smells like a very nice broth. Like soup that you don't mix. I think if I would mix this, I would have a nice chicken soup. Chicken onion soup. Tomorrow is hair washing day. Yeah, for me now, the hair washing day has moved to Sunday now. Normally it's on Saturday. Day two of no washing at all here because of damn three day halted. <gasps> Bass has, can I ask how old are you? And then my second question is why do you need a halter? What's wrong? Do you have uh, issues with your heart? You seem to be too young to have issues on your heart. Sundays and Thursdays. Oh, nice. I'm also going to introduce a new thing in my streams. Um, so I have some of the streams already laid out. Next weekend on Saturday, I will do the warmest waffle stream together with another cool streamer called Abel TV. Uh, she's very nice, she's very kind. She also streams, she streams mostly in uh, Flemish, in Dutch. But she'll be joining our English stream to bake some waffles and those waffles we're going to take to the food bank after uh, and every um, person that makes a donation will donate a bag of stop will donate a bag of waffles to the food bank and can add a little personal note Hi Encounter, how often should we be hair washing again? It actually depends. Yes, yeah, she's so cute. So I've been um, uh, latest because you're here. I've been um, thinking uh, about how I could get some people over here. But I just, I don't think it seems like a good idea because we like we're packing all the stuff for the moving and it's, it's not. <laughs> the majority cleans their kitchen one day after. Good. Creative cooks you are. Making all the messes. Yeah, so um, I, I think it will give me a lot of stress if I would have more people in here. I think it would really give me a lot of stress. So I decided to only go with Abel TV and then when we have the house and the occasion is there again that I can... I can uh, invite more people over. Yeah. <laughs> but I feel like if you want to, because I really want to, that we can meet up someday to hang. That would be nice. I would love that. 
You're gonna miss the stream next Saturday. That's okay, Stony. Um, since you already gave so much, so much to the cause, I will definitely um, let you have a package of waffles. Also, is there any um, like note you want to add to the package? You can send that to me in Discord if you want. When is that stream? Okay, so that's the waffle stream. It's going to be next week on Saturday, so the 10th of December. Uh, and we're going to start two hours before my normal stream time. So it's at 2 p.m. I will translate it for you. I will translate it. A 1 p.m. Yeah, for you it's going to be 1 p.m. I have things <laughs> planned. Anywho. Ah, okay. Okay. But think about it. Let me know if you want to hang out. Just the two of us. And if you don't, it's totally okay as well. You do you, you do your thing, you work on yourself. Next week on the 8th, I will be starting a day shift after 15 years on nights. That is going to be so freaking weird. How do you feel about that? How do you feel about that? It's like, can we hang? Sure. I mean, yes, if I have money again, I will definitely come over to London and we can hang in London. Maybe with like Ben and Lara and you and Laura maybe. How cool would that be? Oh my God, I just made myself way too excited. Yeah, I was like, how can we hang? Like, how do we... I wasn't, I wasn't following. Yes, we will hang. Of course we will hang. I would love to hang. I've turned it down seven times. Why? Why did I ask seven times though? And why did you say yes now? Yeah, it's like Ben doesn't even get to choose. He just has to, he just has to go with the flow. I know retro, they're like super weird. They drive on the wrong side of the road and they have a weird sense of humor and they say tomato instead of tomato but um i think i'm just gonna have to go with it no he isn't true that's true okay it's time oh lordy lord yeah the skin of the potato is getting queasy. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm going to sprinkle some more oil over the potatoes. Okay, I'm going to pop them in just a bit longer. Hey Google, set timer for five minutes. Okay, five minutes, starting now. Then we're going to take them out. And then the chicken will also be done probably. Let me check. Or you can come to visit. I don't need down for the last seven years because nights is quiet. So we have seniority. So when positions need filled, they always have a list they have to follow. Ooh, night shift <laughs> shift is proven to kill you at a younger age. What? Really? Okay, I understand why you're a bit anxious <laughs> about this all. Like, did they say that to to um, let you convert to the the day shift? Because that sounds very suspicious. Like, what? Mm. 
look at this guys would you look at that it's so perfect probably yeah i i guess i believe it i do believe it though i think that it may indeed be very bad for you to work night shifts but still it's like because you just don't you just turn around your um your day night schedule or is it because you don't get enough sunlight then thank you latest the recipe it's like very easy very easy recipe very weeknight dinner type uh, and it's chicken you can never go wrong with chicken well 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 speak of the devil hi michael hi roly thank you so much for the raid yeah yeah we were totally gossiping about you i'm sorry we're like she's gonna eat all the waffles instead of giving them to the the food bank <laughs> no no that's, that's not true <laughs> hi thank you so much for the raid welcome in bros my name is clara clara coffee this is my kitchen how are you doing how was the stream oh you played lol <laughs> nice how was it did you kill them all we're having a, a glass of white vino with some chicken and caramelized onion sauce and our smashed potatoes are doing their thing, basically. I killed them all. <laughs> nice. Very good. Well trained. I was talking about how we uh, are going to bake the waffles next week on this stream. Oh, you moved. Congratulations on moving! How are you doing? How was the moving? Was it intense? Was it crazy? Are you okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Congrats on the moving. How is your kitchen so clean? Mine is a landfill and I just smeared some bread. They're like little dwarfs in here and they clean whenever I do the b-rolls they take over and they clean the kitchen that's how how I do it it's true you're going to steal the cleaning drawers hell no those are my cleaning drawers get your own find your own in the woods Take the bacon on there. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Taste it. I think she needs to be put on meds. I don't see little people. You don't? Because they hide. Stop. <gasps> Do I see. Do I see a golden bean? Hi, Asterix. Thank you so much for the 43 months of supporting my teeny tiny coffee channel. Thank you so much. You're one of the OGs for sure. How are you doing? How is life? Five months until four years. Crazy, right? It's crazy. The move was intense, but I'm so happy I can stream again. Almost forgot how much I love it. You know, I can totally understand that. It's like, it feels like a habit. And when you cannot do that again, it's great. Oh, thank you so much for the resub. Asterix, Asterix. Uh, what color would you like? Need to put up more sheet rock. What is that? 
Oh, the kitchen. When will it be done? You're doing such an amazing job. Yellow gold, yellow gold. Nice. What color would you like, Awel? We have yellow, pink, orange, purple, red, blue, or green. Blue, I do. Good choices, good choices. I'm very happy that the kitchen is working out for you, Astrid. You're doing such an amazing job. We will move. It's now. It's now done. Finished with. We will move. That uh, we will get the keys the eighth of January, and we will move the fourteenth of January. It's very exciting. It is indeed. I'm also very excited to give you guys a house tour. So I've been thinking, let me know what you think about it. I've been thinking um to like do a little uh, apartment tour video and then the house tour so it's like or make a video that i go from this setup to snap the kitchen setup yeah met the clip met birgit wait what hi pepin Ik was nog even de wachten zeven afleveringen aan het herbekijken van Zoe eet pita, Zoe eet pita, Zoe eet pita. En dat doet ze zo, dat doet ze zo. Oh yeah. Oh, that was that came from very far in my memory. Damn. Wait, wait. Saya has cramps. Wait. Hoe gaat het, Pepijn? It takes a lot of trial and error to fit the pieces. Ugh. But Sai, you just literally just had dinner. Did you eat something wrong? How is the 